So I'm here with Matt James. He's a member of the Yakima Valley Yaks. He's a catcher. And, and Matt, first question I have for you, you know, with the season being brand new, starting out, what things are you hoping to focus on, hoping to accomplish this year? We just want to be collective as a team, good in every aspect of the game. Um, you know, if you're good at everything, that's hard not to win. Um, and that's our goal is to win an NWAC championship. So we just want to go out there, do our best every day, get better every practice, and get better every game as a team. And then for you, I mean, you're, you're here now, but you were at Notre Dame last year. And then, of course, high school. What are the differences you see, especially between, like, high school and college, but even between um, a community college versus, like, a four-year school like Notre Dame? Well, I mean, obviously from high school to college in general is a big jump. You just see a lot more consistent talent across the board and guys who want it more. Um, in regards to a four-year versus a two-year, it's just – more than anything, it's a lot um, more like traveling and stuff, and the guys there are the best of the best when it comes to amateur baseball. Um, you get to play phenomenal competition, but the guys at Juco Ball, they grind. They want to be at that four-year school and at the same level as I was last year. And, um, you know, if you work hard, then you can definitely get there. And then, you know, you are here with Yakima now. What about this program kind of drew you in and kind of um, excited you to be a part of it? Uh, great coaching staff and a great team tradition is uh, kind of what brought me here. I've known Coach Crust Angel for a few years now. I was recruited and signed to Yakima out of high school, actually, before going to Notre Dame. Um, and everything about the program is just really good, the way that they run things, the way that their players play, the way that the guys act with each other. It's just a good atmosphere to play baseball. Ball in. Yeah, definitely. Watching them last with the NWAX was a lot of fun to see the, the whole team. Um, but, you know, also for, for being out here at the college level, it's not an accident. It takes a lot of work, a lot of time. But who in your life would you say kind of kept you going, kept motivating you and pushing you to, to be as best as you can be? Really, my dad did. Um, he was working with me ever since I was three years old, heading off the tee in the backyard. And he's always kind of been there for me, just motivating me when I need it. Um, I've always been pretty self-motivated, but there's been a ton of people people, coaches, one-on-one -on -one coaches, you know, coaches of select teams growing up. There's been a ton of people motivating me, but biggest thanks goes to my parents for paying the money to let me do this, get here. Absolutely. Money, uh, it does cost a little bit to play this game. Yeah. And then, you know, also growing up, a lot of players will look at major league players and, and, you know, they'll either mimic them with their style or even just their attitude. Is there a player that you've watched and been like, you yeah, know, I kind of like what they do. I want to be like that. I always loved uh, Joe Mal and Vladimir Guerrero growing up. So I loved Mauer's consistency and his catching ability and how he could hit as a catcher. Mm -hmm. And what I loved about Vlad Guerrero is he was just aggressive all the time. And I love the way he plays, just swinging at everything and hitting it hard. So I, I really like both those guys growing up. Awesome. Last question I have for you, you know, Playing at, playing at this level, you have tons of, of kids who come out and watch games. What advice would you have for them as they try and make it to the next level? I'd say just work as hard as you can. That's what that's what will get you to the next level. I mean, a lot of kids have natural talent but don't put work into it. You just got to work hard and go out there every day. You got to really want it to get here. Awesome. Well, thank you very much. All right. Thank you.